This is the evolution of the Opel Corsa, one of the most popular small cars in Europe, with over 14 million units sold since its launch in 1982. But how did the Opel Corsa come to be so popular and sought after by customers even after 40 years? Let's find out. The first generation Opel Corsa rolled off the production line for the first time in the autumn of 1982 as an affordable and practical alternative to the larger and more expensive models from the same brand. Thus, chief engineer Erhard Schnell created a small, sporty car with clear, chiseled lines. The result was a simple and functional car that stood out for its reliability and economy, with gasoline or diesel engines available, with powers between 45 and 70 horsepower. As a result, the Corsa A was a commercial success, selling more than 3.1 million units worldwide. In the 90s, the Corsa was refreshed with new bumpers, headlights, grille, and revised interior. The second-generation Corsa brought a major change in the appearance and features of the car. Appel design legend Hideo Kodama created a Corsa with a more rounded and modern design. Under the hood, the engines available were gasoline or diesel, with powers between 45 and 109 horsepower. The Corsa B also proved to be a commercial success, selling more than 4 million units worldwide. In 1997, Appel refreshed the second-generation Corsa more technically than design. Thus, while the design remained largely the same under the hood, a 1-liter 3-cylinder engine and a 1.2-liter 4-cylinder engine were installed. The third-generation Corsa was launched in 2000, and because Hideo Kodama's design proved to be successful, he also designed the Corsa C. Thus, it had a large and more aerodynamic appearance for the first time, the body was completely galvanized. The engines available were gasoline or diesel with powers between 58 and 125 horsepower. The Corsa C also became a star and sold 2.5 million units. The Corsa C also benefited from a facelift in 2003, which received a new grille, new headlights with a sharper and more aggressive look but also new tail lights with a clearer design and a new tailgate with a more aerodynamic shape. Inside, the car received a new dashboard with a more ergonomic and refined design. The fourth-generation Opel Corsa brought a radical change in the style and dynamics of the car. The Corsa D had a sportier and more dynamic design, with headlights elongated towards the hood and accentuated lines. The interior was an evolution, but not a revolution. Under the hood, the Corsa received gasoline or diesel engines with powers between 60 and 192 horsepower. The Corsa D also received a facelift in 2011, which brought a new grille and new headlights with a more oval and sleeker look. At the rear, the car received new tail lights with a cleaner and more modern design. The Corsa D was a commercial success, selling more than 2.8 million units worldwide. In 2014, the fifth-generation Opel Corsa appeared, being the last generation developed by the German manufacturer before being taken over by PSA, Peugeot Citroën. The Corsa continued to become more and more elegant with new wing-shaped headlights and a lower trapezoidal grille. This time, the interiors has been really improved with a more modern and better-defined dashboard. Under the hood, it was powered by either gasoline or diesel engines with outputs ranging from 70 to 207 horsepower. The fifth generation has sold over 1.3 million units worldwide. In 2019, Opel launched the sixth generation Corsa, which truly represented an evolution. Everything was designed to be more sporty and it doesn't look bad at all. Even from any angle you look at it, the new interior brought two new infotainment systems, Multimedia Navi and Multimedia Navi Pro. The 7 and 10 inch both were real time traffic information, roadside assistance at the touch of a button. Under the hood, Appel offers gasoline engines, but also for the first time an electric engine of the Corsa E model. Appel Corsa reinvented itself with a spectacular facelift. The German subcompact changes its face with the Opel visor element, which includes the new grille and LED matrix headlight, more performance and more elegance. The back does not remain unchanged, but proudly displays the model name in large letters. 
The Opel Corsa offers a more modern and intelligent passenger compartment, which includes intuitive infotainment and a central 10-inch touchscreen. The Corsa makes history with its first 48-volt mild hybrid engine, which offers two power options, 100 horsepower or 136 horsepower. The new Corsa also has a purely electric version with two electric motors, one of 136 horsepower and the other one of 156 horsepower. So it's more than 40 years of existence. Opel Corsa has conquered the hearts of millions of drivers around the world thanks to its quality, reliability and affordability. The Opel Corsa is not just a car, but a piece of automotive history that continues to reinvent itself and surprise you. Tell us in the comment section, what do you think about the evolution of the Opel Corsa over time?